We all care deeply about education. It defines the future. But when we discuss how to improve it, we tend to focus only on the sending. How good is the curriculum? How good are the teachers? We completely ignore the receiving. Can the students hear what's being taught? The shocking truth is that millions of children leave their education every year having simply not heard one of four spoken words. Children are left to their own devices when it comes to the vital life skill of listening. This wouldn't matter so much if every classroom were fit for purpose, if every student enjoyed perfect reception of speech. Sadly, that is not the case. The key is speech to noise ratio. If the background noise is too loud, students simply can't hear what they're being taught. This is true for all, though the effects are particularly severe for students with hearing impairment, those learning in a second language, or those with learning challenges like ADHD. Noise also creates stress, so it's no surprise that educators commonly rank vocal fatigue and classroom noise amongst their top challenges. The key to solving the problem is better classroom acoustics. If we block out noise from outside and from neighbouring classrooms, we start from a good place. Then, for maximum speech intelligibility, we need to absorb sound so that unwanted reflections don't impair clarity. And at the same time, the whole room gets quieter, tilting the speech-to-noise ratio in the teacher's favour. A simple solution and a modest cost, and yet the results could be a transformation in our educational outcomes. One where all the children receive all the education we owe them. How would that change the future?